Dr. Matt Nidal. I'm an orthopedic surgeon specializing in foot and ankle surgery here in Kansas City. So a lot of times, not every time, but a lot of times when people have a foot and ankle procedure done, they may have to be non-weight bearing for some period of time to allow the tissues to heal correctly. It may be with crutches or a walker or a wheelchair or something called a roller aid that you scoot around on. So in general, crutches are good for younger active patients or even older active patients. If they have good arm strength, then it's a good option for them. Um, they're very versatile, they're lightweight, and you can get them into different places. So a roller aid is, is a uh, platform that has wheels under it um, that people can scoot around on. They kind of put their knee on it. I guess some people that probably wouldn't use it would be people with severe knee problems uh, or people who have bad coordination. Um, a lot of my patients like it. It doesn't require, you know, huge arm strength to be able to propel just leg strength with your other leg. So you need another good leg. So walkers are, are generally the older population usually uses that and they um, don't have the arm strength to work with crutches and they don't really have the coordination to work with a roller aid and they might actually fall if they use a roller aid incorrectly. So it's basically good for that kind of population. Generally wheelchairs are for people who really have minimal coordination and or they've had you know surgery on both of their legs. You may propel yourself if you have good arm strength, but if, if you don't, then you may need someone else to help you do that. If you have any questions about your post-operative recovery and how you may need to modify your activities, feel free to give us a call.